So I've started having a salad every single day and my other garlic and butter croutons finished. So now I'm on to these ones. They're called seasonal. And these literally, literally taste like pizza. So my salad is turning into pizza now and I love it. I literally taste like pizza, the croutons. I don't know what, must be like a lot of tomatoes and stuff. And I don't know, tastes so good though. You can get them at Food Basics. Rachel, she got me this Blue's Clues pin because um, they didn't send her it and so they sent her a second one. So she gave this one to me. David's tea packages, they put a lot of tissue paper in it so you can always reuse it for Christmas time. So I'm going to save all of this and I'm going to step on this. Welcome back! I will be showing you my uh, grateful journal that I've made. I haven't really continued it for a while, but I was looking through a bunch of my stuff and I found this notebook again, which I wanted to use for school, but I was reading inside of it what I have written in it and it's so cute and I want to keep this going. So in this notebook, I was writing three things that I'm grateful for every single day and I started it on Thursday, November 22nd, 2018 and I did it for like a little bit. I didn't even like continue it for long. Anyways, so on November 22nd, 2018, I was grateful because I made it to my therapy session on time. There was ice on the window and I love to look at like the icy designs on the windows because they're like always different and thirdly I got to sleep in so and, and then on the 23rd of November there was an easy in-class assignment I had all my meals I was messaging and getting to know new friends made it to preschool shift on time I used to work as a preschool teacher so and the shift would start in the morning so it would always be so hard to get to me and my coworker would literally like always be late or I would see her on the bus anyways. And I was 130 pounds, so I had gained and I was working out a lot back then. So I was happy about that. And I had a well-deserved nap. Now I don't have naps because they interfere with my sleep schedule, but. And then another one is new lavender soap and washroom. It smells really good. I reply to all my emails. I love when there's new soap in my washroom at home because a new scent, a new, like, it just represents a new beginning. You know, you get to have a new scent every now and then. It's really good. And I learned new study habits in a leadership workshop. I used to go to leadership, leadership workshops at my school, but I think I've been to most of them and I can't really sit still for very long anymore without getting anxious. So um i'm kind of struggling with that in class too so i just like have to take breaks and i look weird like taking breaks a lot but i'm paying for school so whatever and i met new three new people so cute my little handwriting uh i had a day to rest funny group messages hung out with my friend david it was his birthday on november 28th Ooh, i should wish him every november 28th because he was my not first friend but my best friend in, in uh, college for my first two years me and him graduated together i don't talk to him anymore but funny hq seinfeld edition um i don't know if they got rid of the hq app but i think my brother told me that because he was really into it but yeah they used like it was a um not survey but it was like um, where they ask questions and then you can like, if you know the answer, then you press it and then you can earn money. And I saw my prof from, from Physiology of Fitness and she said hi to me. Oh, I wrote a little happy face. So cute. See, little things like that. Like if you say hi to me, I'm like, I'm happy. 
and I love when strangers like smile at me or when people are really nice. Another one that I said is secretary assistant on counseling wished me a, a nice weekend. Even that, like take care, have a nice weekend. I love when people say that. Uh, and then I bought Cassandra Clare's new books. I love Cassandra Clare. I love the Mortal Instruments series. I don't like the TV show, but I did watch the movie and the movie was good. I watched it on my birthday actually, which was the best birthday and i have some of her books but i haven't started them i just love looking at the covers uh i bought rose leggings lol yeah i did and i don't like them anymore so i got rid of them they're not really like leggings uh funny guy waiting 43 minutes for bus lol funny man and italian woman making jokes um i was waiting for the 70a bus um, by Eglinton and the bus takes forever and the bus kept saying like 56 minutes 59 minutes and this one guy was in there waiting for 43 minutes and we were like oh you better tell the bus driver like that you were waiting for, for like for so long and he didn't want to and so he just like got on the bus then he was like but he was so angry and he was like yeah he was really funny and so me and this other me and this lady and this other guy were like just like making jokes and we were just like yeah it was so funny uh, reading Lady Midnight, which is a Cassandra Clare book, messaging Kim, oh yeah, that was my boss at the time, physio, sleep, talking to Carl, oh damn, so back in December in 2018, I I injured my wrists, now they're re-injured again, so I went for physio, that didn't work, <sighs> but it's funny that I even wrote it in this, anyway, seeing dentists after one year, oh my gosh, girl, you gotta go twice a year, six months, what was, what was I doing in 2018? quiz was okay guy in class snoring <laughs> yeah there was a guy in class snoring one time uh let's see free christmas lunch yeah i love free food um hanging out with rachel talking with my mom and dad uh eating dinner with my older sister Blending my smoothie outside, I had a long sleep, I ate all my meals, I started notes, helped my dad photocopy, it was my dad's birthday, me and my sister Rachel looked up Maisie stuff, we relaxed, focused on studying, ate all my meals, memorized a lot, waiting, writing in test center, which is a lot quieter than like writing in like the classroom, done exams, I saw my friend, uh, my sister got me a burrito, my brother got me a soft shell taco the uber driver gave me water um i talked with my brother telling laura about something funny doing a survey eating chocolate it was chinese new year i talked to my professor and school was canceled on thursday february february 6 2019 i guess because of the snow i don't remember but yeah so that's it i'm going to be filling it in because I have a lot of pages. Um, new stuff that I'm grateful for every single day. It might not be three because three is a lot. I might just write one and try to continue it. But yeah, that's it. That's my grateful notebook. It says follow your dreams. And it's so cute. I got it from, I don't know if it was Urban Planet or Urban Outfitters. But when um, one of those stores closed down at Fairview Mall. So... I copped a bunch of notebooks and I wish I got more because they're really good for like semesters like you could just use one a semester uh, and I love this so you could just put the pen hanging here and yeah so that's it for this video I will show you or look back on things that I'm grateful for in a year's time because I'm gonna start doing that and bye